If Velvet could do it, there's no way I can't. How many times do you plan to destroy and rebuild your own heart, Magilu? We're on a hundred and seven. Who was it? A hundred and eight. I lost count. Not that I really care. Pathetic fool. Did I not tell you it would require an iron will as indomitable as the very trees that live and die across millennia? over there <sighs> that is the foundation of an ideal world one free from man's sins <laughs> an ideal world huh <laughs> you kid the boy who was your companion Laffy said he's alive Chasing a terrifying demon girl, he has learned the immensity of the seas and weathered the dry wastes of the land. <sighs> Those people, they're different from us. Despite the pain, the anguish, they embrace the life they've been given. They live undaunted by the ugliness of the world! <gasps> So you're doing this all for them? Is that what this is? <laughs> Not even close. They aggravate me to my wit's end. <laughs> like stabs in the chest, over and over and over. And that's exactly why. That's why I intend to see how all of this ends. I won't be satisfied until I do. Words bereft of meaning. You truly are my greatest failure. Gosh, funny just how little I care. No, please! Let me guess. We came at a good time? You're late. Because of you, I had to have a really boring conversation. So, you came face to face with Inominat. If so, then you must know that your quest for revenge is utterly meaningless. Yeah, I did. I know why sadness fills the world. And I know how deep are the burdens of sin. I tried to abandon my memories of Arthur and Laffy, to cut myself off from it all, and end this tragedy. It's... it's what they would have wanted. Exactly. You do well to know your place. But that's exactly why I can't forgive them. Not Artorius, not Inominat. I know my heart is ugly and full of contradictions, but those days we spent together in familial warmth, they're proof that I, that all of us, were truly alive. That's why, no matter how hard, no matter how sad it gets, I will take my vengeance to the very end! Don't be a fool. Just give up and die like you ought. It is your destiny to wallow in despair. You take my family, turn me into a monster, and you want my soul too. Now who's being the fool? Remember this well. The Lord of Calamity never gives up, not even in the face of death. Have you no shame for your sins, you unholy monster? <laughs> Let me in on this. Hello? 
lost a bet, and I've got some anger to work out. You sure you can fight in your condition? Who do you think I am? Ooh, I thought you'd never ask. I am the dastardly witch Moggy Lou, scourge of self-righteous exorcists! Now face the wrath of Moggy Lou Maven! Fools, all of you! Fear me! Everyone, sorry to have worried you. I wasn't worried. I didn't realize you were someone who needed looking after. Me neither. This is our way of saying we trust you. Yeah. You horrible interest! See? Step to the chest. That's all you need me. Urban, win! Artorius and you know me not. They took something precious from me. I'll never forgive them for that. The annals of history are stained with evil people like you. 
You spread havoc and destruction, all to satisfy your own ends. A dark font of malevolence. You're a demon lord, the irredeemable embodiment of sin. The lord of calamity. It is the exorcist's duty to destroy you. You talk a lot. How about you keep talking and tell us where Eifried is? You'll regret this. I can feel Inominot. He's coming! We can fight here no longer. Bienfu, close the rift! I can't! Come forth! Carelessness will get you killed. Zavid! <sighs> you ruined the moment. Huh? Don't you mean, thanks for saving us, Zavid? You're my hero and role model? Thank you for saving us, Zavid. Where exactly are we now? We're in an abbey facility on Hexen Isle. I heard Melchior was in charge here. So I snuck in. I hadn't expected an extra-dimensional space. Is there a way out? There is now that I've busted my way in. Let's head outside. We can talk then. Uh... Who's that? A friend. His name is number one. Hey, wanna come with us? If you stay here alone, a dragon might get you. I bet you wouldn't like that. Yeah, that sounds scary. Great! Come on, kid. What are you doing? We can't leave him like this. I'll get him a vessel, somehow. <sighs> Do what you like. Thank you.